So this, this one actually makes me happy. This one actually makes me happy. A man who was completely paralyzed is now walking because they repaired his spinal cord. That's using, amazing. That is actually amazing and, and good for him and God bless him. And you know why that kind of thing is amazing? And if you, if you are at home watching this and you are poor, this is one of the things that should motivate you to get rich because shit happens. This man was asking earlier, oh, what would you do if you lost a leg? What would you do if you got cancer? What would you do? First and foremost, if I got cancer is I would get the best medical treatment money could buy. So very few people know this. In fact, I'm going to cover this right now because a lot of people are asking me, oh, Tristan was in hospital. It was on his Instagram. Tristan's in hospital. Did he have a heart attack? Because people don't know about me. I went to hospital voluntarily to fix an old kickboxing injury that I had. Now, the same surgeon who operated on my shoulder and reconstructed, I should still be in a cast, obviously, but I'm smoking with this arm because I'm not a little pussy, is the same surgeon who fixed Roger Federer's elbow, Conor McGregor's leg, and it cost me loads of money, but my shoulder feels great. You see, I don't have to. I don't have to rely on some crappy surgeon. I have to wait weeks. Medical care is the best thing in the world. Yeah, and money's, you need money. Money's real. So if I have got paralyzed, I'd find the doctor that did this, and I'd be like, "Now I'm not paralyzed." That makes me super happy to know that this is now available on the market. That's super cool to know. Hopefully, I never need it. But God bless this guy and good for him. Absolutely. If you're a full grown man and you are not absolutely and utterly motivated for the fact that you are going to need money to escape slavery and to live as long as possible and to give yourself and your family the best human experience, then you are a born loser. Yeah. If you're not obsessed with money, you're a born loser. Yeah. You should be obsessed with money.